This is why I love my third gen Camaro. Besides all the MILFs being attracted to me now, and all the boomers trying to buy it off me, this thing's actually really, really fun. First, you can blast Motley Crue, Rat, Metallica, all those metal bands from the 80s that everybody loves or loves to hate, like Trickster or Winger, and you're never gonna get any looks. You're only gonna get thumbs up or a nod or people staring you down because you know you're driving a 40 year old car on the daily streets and it's 5 p.m. and it's the middle of traffic and you're disturbing people because your car's loud exhaust is, uh, well, loud. Also, no third brake light, so you're gonna get pulled over a lot by cops asking you, hey, uh, where's your third brake light? And you secretly know that they're actually interested in buying your car because they know that your 140 horsepower Camaro is a lot faster than their V8 Charger. And they know that their girlfriend was looking at it the other day. And now they're jealous because their Honda Civic Type R is not as masculine as a third gen Camaro. Also, T-tops. T-tops are just cool. T-tops are like if a car had a mullet. Like, come on, you can't argue with T-tops. They totally don't leak. Totally. And also, the interior totally doesn't rattle. It's, it's just character, you know? And you don't need to worry about a radar detector either because it's not like the car can ever do anything faster than the speed limit without, well, you know, getting 11 miles per gallon and only being able to do 120 miles an hour after, you know, four years. But at least you look cool. Also, the Quadrajet, it, it, it gets heat soaked, so every time you stop at a light, you have to uh, blip the throttle just to keep it alive sometimes. Sometimes, it's not fun. And don't forget the headlights, you know, where you have to use all four of them and the high beams just to be able to see at night. And everybody knows you're driving a third gen because it's loud and it's going slow and you're keeping up traffic on Route 90. Because if you do over 85, you're getting 11 miles per gallon. Anyways, that's why I love my third gen Camaro. Why'd I wait so long for one of these? Should've, should've just built my Mustang instead, instead of buying this. I jinx myself now. Totally, totally didn't buy my childhood dream car and kind of regret it. Yeah, if you like a slow third gen content and a Mustang that doesn't run, or hasn't moved in like four years, remember to subscribe, like, and comment your favorite hair metal band. Red truck out, cheers, yellow.